wear a mask, get vaccinated, and follow your local health guidelines. Do not get your medical information from Tucker Carlson, who admits he lies on his show, who spreads vaccine misinformation along with the rest of Fox News, who supports people lying about their vaccination status. Patrick Lane made the mistake of watching some Tucker Carlson videos and believing what he was seeing was factual. He made the mistake of believing that Tucker Carlson was accurately reporting news and wasn't being an entertainer, just telling people what they wanted to hear. And that cost him his life. Let's see what Katie Lane has to say about her father. 45. No pre-existing underlying medical conditions that make him a larger danger for COVID. Let's see what she has to say. He was getting information that led him to be hesitant on vaccines. Who? I mean, who was he listening to? Uh, he, he watched some Tucker Carlson videos on YouTube. Uh, and some of those videos involved some misinformation about vaccines. Mm. And I believe that that played a role. And if she knows he's watching it on YouTube, it's because he was telling her about it. He was mentioning it to them. They weren't over his shoulder. He believed the misinformation. Or they wouldn't have known that he was watching the Tucker Carlson videos. Or they wouldn't have known that that's what those videos were about. He waited for FDA approval. A lot of people did because Tucker Carlson, it's not approved. It's not approved. That was too late and he died. He died when he shouldn't have because he believed falsely from right-wing media playing a political game that he should wait for FDA full approval. Even though millions had had the vaccine, even though it was 100% getting approval, he waited. And it cost him his life. And who did the family blame? Tucker Carlson of Fox News.